Hey, Jit Squad, welcome back to the of Is It Worth It? So today's episode, we got this cool arms around here and basically what this is, is a disc drying rack. And we see for the one that we got right here from this brand, and the way how they designed this one in particular is actually pretty big. It's way bigger than your typical disc drying rack, which is pretty cool. So you see right here, they do have the option for you guys to put like small stuff, like maybe your utensil, your fork and spoon, etc. Whereas right here, they do give you guys the option to put other stuff like your plates, your bowls, and other stuff as well. And you see in the bottom right here, they do actually have another part, and that is basically where the water would drip on. So basically, once this part right here is filled, you do have the option to pour out the water really easily. I believe for the bottom part, it's detachable, so if you guys want to take it out, you definitely can. But here is basically what the product looks like in the front. Here is this side, here is the back, and here is the other side. And then right here is the top, and right here is the bottom. So when you guys do purchase these disc drying racks, there's actually a lot of different options available. There's like a small one, there's like a medium one, there's like a large one, and the way how they design each one is slightly different. The material that's on this one is like a plastic material. Like I mentioned, this is one of the bigger size. I think this might be one of the biggest one that is available. And if this one is too big for you guys, you can definitely purchase a smaller one instead. But that is basically everything that's on the product. Let me show you guys what the product looks like once you guys do set it up, because I already have another one all set up. But we've basically been using that for over like three years, four years, even maybe more than five years. And it lasted us for so long, so I do know the material that's on here is pretty high quality. But let's go show you guys what it actually looks like first, and it will come back and talk more about it in a second. All right, so right here is basically what the product looks like when you guys do set it up. And you see it's actually very spacious when you guys do put your dishes on here. And then right here, we do have the utensils on the side. And then right here is basically where the water would drip. So what we do right here, you can see we put some towels that actually absorb the water, which is pretty convenient. But here is basically what the product looks like once you guys do set it up. All right, welcome back guys. So now that I saw that video for the one that I've been using, you can see it actually looks pretty nice when you guys do actually use it. And the way how we set it up onto the wall, you can see it fits under perfectly. If we were to use any other disc drying rack where they actually have a little sprout or something for the water to leak out, it won't work for where we actually have it set up, if you can see from the video. But if you guys do prefer the one that has that little sprout for the water to leak out into like the drain or something, you guys can definitely get those instead. But the way how it's set up in the video, this one actually works better in that situation. But that is basically everything that's on the product. Now to go unboxing and test the product, now to answer the question of whether or not it's worth it or not. So for this product, I do have to say that it's pretty worth it if you guys want to need one of these, especially if you guys are in the market looking for a high quality disc drying rack, like the one that we got right here, then I do have to say that it's pretty worth it. <laughs> but then obviously for those of you guys who don't want or don't need one or have one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else that you actually do need. So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That will definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.